What? When we go home? Wait, I'm doing. <laughs> we have phones when we go back home. Okay, one second. I'm doing a sound check. Count down from five, and get louder as you go down. Five, four, three, two, one. Ow, oh my gosh, I hurt so bad. I think I just did my hand. I broke my hand for sure. <laughs> I did. Good morning. Early morning. So we've had quite an eventful week. We've spent the last week in uh, Byron Bay, Australia, which was amazing. Um, but about a day before we were supposed to leave to Bali, we got an email that said our flight was canceled because of volcanic ash in the air and flights were unable to land. So The we... email came with a DVD copy of Dante's Peak. <laughs> <laughs> so we were scrambling. I was scrambling. We didn't have internet at our last house, so we kind of had to keep running back and forth to like the library and internet cafes and anyway um, I was calling the airlines and I was like all right well we'll come back to Bali and we'll just try to go straight to Thailand but the flights to Thailand were booked for like two weeks out so we basically opened up our map and decided where we would like to go we saw okay we're in Australia and we want to end up in Thailand but we have this like week that we need to be somewhere. Not Australia, not yet Thailand, but we need to find somewhere in between there for a week where we can end up. Anyways, it was actually kind of fun just being in like the cafe on the streets of Byron Bay. Saying, where should looking, we go? Hey, where should we go with our family for a week? Anywhere within this part of the globe. Anyways, we chose one. Two, three. Singapore. Singa We're in Singapore. So we flew in last night and we are in Singapore and it is beautiful. Yeah, Singapore. Very different, very cool. We we're super excited to go explore, but um, the flight yesterday, man, the kids were champs. I was super nervous. It was an eight hour flight. Manila slept two hours right at the beginning and then was up for a few hours just kind of played and then slept like the last three Like I couldn't have asked for a better flight in the middle of the day When it, your oh. children sleep on a plane you feel like you got away with a crime You feel like getting on the plane you are just holding this ticking time bomb and waiting, for, waiting it. for it to <laughs> let loose and destroy your life forever And when people come up to you after the flight and they're like your kids did so good I didn't hear them you're like Really? Yeah, you just feel like you conquered the world, you're president of the United States and king. I got one. Yeah. <laughs> yep, so here we are, we're in Singapore. We researched in the short 24 hours we had before we arrived here, uh, just what was the most family friendly hotel that we could find in the city. And so here we are at the Mandarin Orchard Hotel on the short drive from the airport to the city. Uh, it just seems so clean, so nice. Everywhere you go, there's the decorations and lights and Christmas trees. It just makes it a lot more fun for our children. Wait, wait. I'm like trying to... Manila's up. We got a Manila bug. Oh, my sleepy face. <laughs> Good morning, Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. <laughs> oh my gosh, he's so dead. Okay, let me tell you what. Buddy, we're in Singapore. Manila has grown so much this trip, but specifically like in the last week. Like stuff has kind of clicked and he's learning so fast. He's got a lot more tricks. I don't know if he's gonna do any tricks right now, but we'll see. <laughs> Okay, my oh, oh, more. This will be your tonight. It's a big sale. More what? The tickle part. Get to the good part. <laughs> what does a pig say? <gasps> Look who's awake. <gasps> my Dorothy. Come here, our buttons. Come here. Good morning. Come here, come here. Oh, pretty princess pie. Hey, Dorothy. 
Where are we? Singapore, thanks for the warm greeting when the sun finally comes up because it's still like 4 30 in the morning. We are gonna go explore your beautiful city. So, see you then. Stop. No, no, stop. 